A new report has found that wind and solar-led energy systems can deliver electricity at similar or lower cost than today's fossil fuel-based systems. According to the Energy Transitions Commission, electricity is projected to provide up to 70% of global energy consumption in a decarbonized energy system. Today, it only accounts for 20%. Total global electricity demand could triple by 2050. This demand could be reached by new generation wind and solar power. And the report also shows that China could achieve fully renewable power systems, a total cost of $47 per megawatt hour by 2050, well below today's average wholesale prices. Lord Adair Turner is the chair of the Energy Transitions Commission and joins us now. Lord Adair, thank you so much for your time. Donald Trump said this week in Scotland uh, that wind-powered energy was the most expensive. Has he got it completely wrong? Yes, he's got it completely and utterly wrong. And indeed, China is the clearest indication of how wrong that is. You're seeing dramatic reductions in the cost of uh, uh, wind turbines in China and very significant uh, deployment of very cheap uh, uh, wind power uh, installations, wind farms. And across many parts of the world where there is good wind, of course it depends on the wind resource, um, onshore wind is one of the cheapest ways to produce electricity along with solar, which in sunny parts of the world is even cheaper.